Hey guys, it's Annika Panika and today I am doing an empties video again. So this is the, I believe the fourth one. So number four and and I am a little sick, like a little stuffy nose. So if it might look a little red or it might sound a little different, that's the reason why. And don't mind my kind of like weird looking hair today. But, uh, so yeah, let's get started and we're going to start out with uh, skincare and makeup products. The first thing I grabbed are the Cucumber Towelette Makeup Remover Wipes from the Up and Up brand. And I love these to take off my foundation. I use them every night. And this one has one more left and then this one's totally empty so I would definitely be repurchasing them. The next thing is a moisturizer. This is the dual treatment moisturizer. This is the dual treatment moisturizer from the Up and Up brand too. And this is the the one that compares to the dual action moisturizer, which I, I had and I really liked. And I tried this one and at first I liked it, but like when I start I don't know why, but I noticed that when I would put it on, it it like make my face feel dry and like like you know that feeling where you, like you can't move and it just feels weird, so then I feel like I would have to apply more, but it just doesn't do anything. So I would just like put this under a different moisturizer. So I don't think I'd like repurchase this, but it was okay. So yeah. The next thing I have is a clear soul clear soul daily pore cleansing pads and I just use these just to get like the rest of my makeup off and just to kind of cleanse my face just because I sometimes don't feel like washing my face every time I take off my makeup so I just use this and I already repurchased this because it's just easy and cheap. The next thing is another moisturizer. This is the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion and I had this for a long time so it was kind of old but I know they still have it. And I, this is the moisturizer that I'd put on top of that other one because, you know, it's just drying. And uh, this one I liked. I just didn't like the smell. I don't know why it, like, it just smelled old probably because it is old, but it was okay. And it just made my, fa my face look really oily, but it's just shiny and just really, really moisturizing. So I probably will repurchase this because I'm using a different one and I like it. So, and this one's like more expensive. So, but yeah, it's a good one. Next is a Clean Clear Deep Cleaning Toner, and I really like this. It was in several of my favorites videos, and I think it smells really good, and I'm actually using a different kind this time, a different brand. And, um, yeah, I like this. I will probably, like, pur repurchase this in the future, but yeah, mm -hmm, liked it. The next thing is a Bath & Body Works Honey Sweetheart Shower Gel, and I really like this scent, but, um, I'm pretty sure it's just, like, a summer-spring scent, so I don't think they would have it, um... But yeah, I really like this, and I always use Bath & Body Works shower gel and lotions. And then I also have the matching uh, Triple Moisture Body Cream, so I just like use this all and put it all over my body after my showers, and then I also use the Twilight Woods one up too. So, and it's funny because they both like have like that shape, because when I squeeze it all out. So yeah, I really like this stuff, and I use them up pretty fast. <laughs> On to like three makeup items that I have. Um, I have the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, and it's not, like, completely empty, but it, I hit pan on it. And I really want to try, like, other powders just so I don't always have to use this one. Get to know other powders. <laughs> and then I have the Rocket May uh, Maybelline Mascara, and I... This is, like, a really old one. It was actually, like, my sister's. And, um, I would just use this for my bottom lashes because... I really liked the brush for my bottom lashes because I just got every single lash, but now it's like dried out and just old and probably dirty, not good for your eyes. So I haven't used it in a long time because it's been in my empties little bag thing. So yeah, I'll probably get this maybe in the future, but not like currently or anything. Then I have this Blueberry EOS lip balm and see it's just totally like flat, but I can still use it. So I still apply it and stuff so and I'll probably repurchase this I really want to get the orange one the tangerine and the honeydew one so moving on to hair products I only have two I have my favorite rusk um a rusk I'm not sure how to pronounce it but the flat iron spray I really like this stuff um right now I'm using a different one because I just really needed one so I just my mom got this one that was like on sale or something so yeah, I really like this. I'll probably purchase this once I need it again. And, uh, yeah, I just really like it. Next, I have the Suave Dry Shampoo. 
And um, this one's okay. It smells good. Um, it's, I don't know, it's it's okay. I don't think I'll repurchase this because I really want to try other ones. And I really like the Batiste one. Currently, I have a different one because I like to try things out and see which kind is, like, my favorite. And so this one was all right. Next, going on to um, some hand soaps. The first one is the Heirloom or Heirloom Pear from, it's a deep... Uh, antibacterial deep cleansing hand soap and this one smells so good and I only have a little bit left but it doesn't really come out so sometimes I just have to like dump it into my hand but it smells really good and uh, these are both from Bath and Body Works and then the next one is the Scarlet Pumpkin foam soap so this one was really good I really like the smell and even though it's more like a fall scent I don't really care I just need soap to wash my hands after going to the bathroom so yeah, I really liked these. I'll probably purchase them if I need them, and they just smell really good. The last three things that I have are candles, and this is the Yankee Candle in Sparkling Cinnamon, which smells really good. Mmm, it's just so good. And so, this is what it looks like, so obviously I can't get any more of it. And, um, I don't know if I'd clean it. I might clean it out. I don't really know how to and stuff, but maybe I could put cotton balls or something in here. But, yeah, I really like this scent. The next thing is just a candle. It's from Glade, and it was a vanilla one. And I really like the smell, and I kind of just, like, started, like, stabbing the rest of it out. That sounds bad, but I started, like, using, like, a knife or fork or something to get the rest of the wax out. But I really like this, and I'm going to keep this little thing for, like, makeup brushes or something like that. Something useful. The next candle I have is a one... It's a mason jar one from Bath & Body Works, which is Mary Cookie. That's this one on sale. It smells really good. Mm, I could still burn a little bit of it, but it smells so good. And I, don't you hate? Because, like, you burn, you burn a candle because it smells good. You want your room to smell good. And then you have to, like, blow it out, which the smoke just makes it, makes the beautiful scent go away. And then the smoke just, just smells, and then it could, like, get your hair smelly and... So, so then, like, I put the cap on, and then, you know, it just leaves, like, this burnt stuff off, but it, it, it can come off, but still. But some candles that don't have, like, a top or something, like this one, it, did, it didn't have a top, so then you just have to blow it out, or I'd cover it, you know? Or, like, not with my hand, but I'd cover it with something, because I don't want the smoke all up in my room smelling, because then it just ruins the scent, you know? Why do they have things like that? But yeah, that is all for my empties video. I hope you enjoyed it because I think empty videos are honestly like my favorite videos to film and to watch because it's just like because it's a quick review and seeing what other people use. So yeah, hope you enjoyed and see you in the next video. Bye!